Well, I've got one of the patrons of the Gravel Glen Railway here, Mr. Charles Gard. Long time since we had a chat. How are you? Yes, doing? very good, thank you. <laughs> With a different hat on here today, anyway. Indeed, yes. Very exciting. I mean, I've never actually been on the Gravel Glen Railway. I've seen it, but I've never actually taken a trip. It's beautiful. Well, you hear it in the background there. Yeah. It is the most fantastic facility, and you really should come at Christmas because they have over 4,000 people come for the Santa trains. And at Easter, they've got the Easter Bunny and uh, Cliffside concerts, and it's just an amazing uh, facility for the island. But today marks an occasion where the, the, the rolling stock and the, uh, the engines, anyway, increases well, two more. Yes, they've now got eight, actually. Now, it seems almost too uh, many, isn't it? <laughs> well, possibly, but <laughs> I, I mean, these guys love railways, and I occasionally attend their committee meetings, and honestly, the detail, the professionalism that they go into, because they have to run it to the highest possible standards. They're inspected by the UK rail inspectors, and what they don't know about ballast and grommets and all the rest <laughs> of it is just not worth knowing they're an incredible team and the point here of course is all volunteers it's all volunteers they get a lot of uh, support financially mm. but it's not a burden on the manx taxpayer the government do not uh, have to fund this this is as you say raised mm. by volunteers with very generous sponsors now they were recording this uh, they've got the, the uh, laxey to douglas section of the mer celebrating 125 years yes and you're explaining your, your chat about how the boom time was really on this time in, in our history exactly 125 years ago the mer was just beginning to get uh, started and the next year as we'll be next year uh, the Snaefell mountain railway then it was on to ramsey mm. the hotels were being built the gaiety theater was about to be built and boom time for manx tourism it must have been an incredible feeling and other railways had purposes in the sense like the little one in Laxey that just, just services the mines yes. but this was a tourist this was feature, purely was yes yeah. purely tourist because just behind me here is the remains of the pens that the polar bears and the sea lions were in mm. they actually had polar bears and sea lions here which was a tremendous attraction yeah. and the cafe that the current team have rebuilt was here there was another cafe down there there was dancing down in the glen there was the hotel you could spend the whole day here well is everything we've done now or are there things you still want to work on as a team? Uh, there's lots more to do. I think they want to improve the facilities down the line and they will come up with something, don't you worry, to enhance the experience.